there's a lot of deck building games that exist, and all of them have their own little unique twist to them, but none of them are a gardening simulator, <laughs> except for Wild Seasons. This is a, a new roguelike deck gardener, where you're cultivating a garden that grows mystical cards, and then you're orchestrating those decks uh, as your plants evolve. What an interesting sounding game. Uh, this is coming soon. I have a, a key early that allows me to show off this demo to you guys early. The demo is coming to you soon as well. Um, let's play and, and see what's going on with, with Wild Seasons. You can find everything linked in the description down below. Let's play. Uh, so the Season of Beginnings seems that there's there's potentially, maybe this is, is difficulties um, or it's like characters, right? Um, we'll, we'll play the season of beginnings. Start battle with an extra draw um, and start with an extra five dollars. Just seems like kind of a tutorial <laughs> one is, is how I see it. It's, it's only benefits that we have. So the door to your garden stands ahead of you. You summoned your power to begin your journey. As you embark, specters will stand in your way. Deplete the enemy's health to defeat them. You can always see what the enemy plans to do on their turn. Um, I get two actions per turn, and I have to use all of it to end the turn. Interesting. Play cards to defeat the enemy. Drag cards over the target to play. Uh, play a shield card. So you're dealing two damage to me. Um, you're, you're creaking, and you're dealing two damage to me. Um, I will play a shield card, which is Nutmeg. Beautiful. Okay. Cards you play will add power to your constellation. That card just added two. Okay, so we can see at the top uh, the power that we we have here. When the last star is lit up. When the last star lit up is a high power star, your cards have times two effect. Okay. When the last star lit up is a high power star, your cards have times two effect. Interesting. So the amount of power a card will give you is at the top of the card. We, we picked up on that. And then this enemy has a, a special passive. It is only damaged by cards played at high power. Okay, play a card that will leave me at high power. So high power are these ones, right? Um, these are low power. So I can play Micro Basil. Now, is this going to... It's, it's gonna leave me at high power, but it's not going to do any damage because now I'm at high power. Interesting. So the numbers on your cards are doubled now. What a unique mechanic, honestly. Um, you're out of actions end turn. I, I have ended my turn. So you have hit me for two. Uh, you hit my shield. The shield blocks some of that damage. And shield lasts between turns. That's very important. Um, and that was your opportunity playing attack. So we can do... <laughs> yeah, we, we we should we should just play uh, the best attack possible, which is going to be a Torch Lily. You've got the basics down, play the rest of the battle yourself, yourself and I'll see you in the garden. Okay, um, I can hit you, but I can't hit you because you're only damaged at those. So ideally, we would play like some block, and then that puts me at full power on my next turn to hit you for, for six, right? And the cards are staying inside of my hand. So we know we have the Micro Basil. That can hit you for nine. But start me with the Nasturtium, which is going to remove a star, keep me at high power, and then I can hit you with... I mean, I could have hit you with the Torch Lily, but now I can do that. I should have hit you with the Torch Lily, dummy. <laughs> This is a free-to-play card, um, and it has reset my power now. Okay, um, yeah, we should have played, should have played the damn Torch Lily for 10 and, and killed you. It's my bad. Um, we'll survive. So, Nutmeg into a Micro Basil, which obviously does not hit you. Um, I am at full power, and then I'm going to hit you with a, a Torch of the Lily, and I'm going to kill you. Or a Micro Basil, it doesn't matter. Okay, um, little delayed. <laughs> that was my bad. So we have received 10 water as a reward. And now I'm in my garden. So welcome to my garden. This is where I'm going to grow plants that yield the cards that I battle with. Every turn, my plants lose health unless I water them. I have few tools to take care of my plants using them 
costs you water. Okay. Interesting. Um, many tools affect multiple tiles. You can see the shape of tiles over the tool. Try to water three at once. So I will water these three at once. Beautiful. Um, with care, plants might grow into a variation. Right click to learn what a plant can grow into. In the flower corner, you can buy plants to add to your garden uh, or mixins that can upgrade your plants. Dude, what an interesting mechanic in this game. Don't like what's in the shop, you can re-roll. Let's buy a plant, click the plant you, you wish to buy. So we got a sneak peek, this is some parsley, <laughs> I'm assuming that we cannot get right now. Um, sure. Got a peony. Um, I mean, I love draw, five shield, draw, draw two cards. It's a, a one power. It's really interesting to not have mana in this game, right? Um, it's just, you, you strictly have, strictly have two actions a turn. It, it makes it very interesting. I love a three power while in hand, this deals plus 50%. All, all attacks deal plus 50%. You're interesting, right? I mean, I'm going to put you in. You may want to fill your garden as weeds may grow in empty spaces and bloat your deck whenever you're ready head to the next battle. Well, I'd like to I'd like to water some guys, right? So I'm going to move this move plants between tiles. Yeah, thank you. I would like to move you to here. Yeah, just like this. So this costs a water and then I can move you to here and then I can water this. Okay. Very good. Um I haven't visited all vendors yet. Really? <laughs> okay. Um, here's limestone. Chance to raise shield. Chance to raise attack. Interesting. And it's in a, a position like that. So I should... I can limestone right here. Wow, this... Okay, interesting. So you can straight up add two cards. It's not just ones that exist. That's really fascinating. So, so we could do something like this, right? Um, and there's a chance. So now the Nasturtium, this is, it's freaking draw, it's attack, it's shield, and it's free to play. Holy lordy, this is fantastic, right? Damage for damage equal to stars of plants in row. So like, I mean, we could, we could do some wacky things with you, right? I feel like I should just be buying some of this. So let, let's buy you. I'm going to put you here. Um, we start to get... I mean, it's going to be a little... Uh, ideally, you would move... Ideally... <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how, how, you, how you put these. It would require a lot of troweling around to get things where I, where I actually want to put them. You're, you're a 7 damage card, but I can make you better, right? I can move these two and that way you're now an eight damage card and then ideally we would move like the torch lily to here um you don't have any water this round um but you also got three hearts so i'm not i'm not too concerned about that i'm trying to to plant these in an efficient way to water them while still maintaining your value and i i think it's it's going to require a little bit of work on the next one um so you lose health Watered plants might lose health. What the hell, man? Okay, that was horrible. I even watered them and they still hated me. <laughs> okay. Where to first? Only the beach is available in the demo. I will move to the beach. Um, there's a lot going on here, man. Um, where, where did I just go? I was just clicking around, man. What power is the illusion that twists the city so... Okay, um, I'll do what I can. I think that I'm fighting like a freaking boss man that I should not have, I should not have chosen to fight on this round. So you have combo, uh, you intend on gaining six shield and gaining a combo. I would like to probably hit you, is the thing. So let's hit you for eight. Um, and then you know what, let's, let's put up, let, let's hit you for, for four. So we're at high power for, for next turn. Right, and then we'll we'll see what we can do. I mean, one one high value, a nice ten damage attack, I think is completely okay. It's gonna put you one away from full power. You can play a nutmeg to put you at four shield, and then you're at high power for next turn, uh, with the chance of a spicy attack, a little a little eight micro into a six shield. We reset our power counter, um, but I think that's okay. You got 10 health. I mean, if I 
draw halfway decent. So I hit ya, we draw. It's a free to play micro basil. To hit ya for four. I mean, you're hitting me for nine, which is disgusting. And then all of these dandelions are, are pure trash. <laughs> I might as well play the micro basil. Um, that just, that just kind of sucked, right? That just kind of sucked. Wall in hand, everything does more damage. I mean, let's, let's do this. Unfortunately, I did not end up with a, uh, an attack there. Otherwise, we, we probably could have killed you on this turn. You gaining six shield, kind of annoying. But now the chamomile chilling in hand allows me, you know, hit you, hit you for eight. The plus 50% damage, kind of good. Okay. So, I get 10 water. I can choose a vendor to call. Um, for three water by permanent garden supplies. But let's, let's do it, right? I, I don't know what a lot of this means quite yet. Um, so, we, we have a rare soil. Look what I've dug up. All yours for the low price of three. So, we have a, a fountain. Select an empty tile to, to buy. I'm going to assume the fountain waters things. I don't fully understand what I'm doing right now. So <laughs> select an empty tile to buy. Okay, so it's a straight... Oh, simple terracotta pot that waters nearby plants. Sorry, I can't read, apparently. Um, I'm sure that that's a surprise. I should have put it here as well. Although we don't want to water this because it's a weed, right? Like, ideally, we, we shouldn't water the weeds. So this requires me getting combo. It's damn hemlock, brother. Jesus. We have another chamomile. Chamomile. I think it's chamomile. I don't know. <laughs> what do I know, right? Five damage to all enemies. Another torch really. Chance to add, increase, or add buffs. So here's the thing. We, we, we need the water. Um, so let's water you guys. Okay, that actually increased the attack of our basil. Sure. I'm going to water you guys. Nasturtium has now grown. Draw all adjacent plants and make them free to play. So that's, I understand, that's the adjacent plants. I, I misunderstood how this card worked. Wow, dude, there's a lot to think about in this game. Um, so all bushy basil, nutmeg, and chamomile. So that's that's these three we draw with that so ideally we want to move we want to like move this micro basil but not yet i want to water you first and then i want to move this micro basil to here so now you draw the bushy basil the micro basil the nutmeg and the chamomile and then we're going to kill off all the weeds in the deck um do I need the Torch Lily or, or more Chamomile? I mean, you cost two. Or do I just want some, some mix-ins, right? Because we could go... I should have added... Well, th this isn't really in a great spot to do something here. I also... You're watering. <laughs> ah! Dude, there's a lot to think about in this game. Um, it's good. Don't get me wrong. I'm, I'm loving it. This is a... This is a really cool, this is a really cool game. So, six to all enemies, up to eight on the bushy basil. I mean, this is, this is pretty good. Let's harvest you. So, so dandelions all die. And unfortunately, you died. But I only got one, one guy. I'm just clicking, man. I'm not even reading what the hell these do. You're, you're gonna kill me. Okay. What do we got? Just, just play the game, right? Just play the game. Um... So chamomile in hand, we want to get to, I mean, th this Crocosmia is super solid. If I can do like a nine to you, and then let's, let's get rid of a dandelion. You're going to draw a single attack. I'm going to get obliterated here. So you draw a bushy basil, and now your Crocosmia does 21. Which I think is really solid. Okay. Now you're you're taking half of my shield, for which I have none. You're adding lint to my deck. <laughs> Go for it. Yeah, add lint to my deck. That's fine. 
Give me a micro basil. I'm I'm at full uh, power, but let's just hit you for four here. The ideal scenario is we draw a card that gives me nine on this. I drew the lint. You're hitting me for ten. This did not go according to plan. G give me this and a dandelion. I'm still at full power. Um, I take two damage, right? What is rest, by the way? Spend an action to reset power to zero and redraw for four cards. Interesting. I haven't felt the need to do that quite yet. But maybe soon. Um, play this, which resets you back one, and then you can play a free-to-play Bushy Basil for 24. Okay, you you can see the win condition, and it's it's decent, right? Propagate for, for three chance to duplicate a plant. That's kind of sick, right? That's kind of sick. So some plants fade away. Uh, we lose that guy, but now you still got some guys in here. This chickweed is unfortunately getting watered, so we want to move your ass out here. <laughs> and then propagate. Pick a plant, and I'll try to propagate it onto adjacent empty tiles. Okay. Um, three for each attempt. Ah! Okay. So start me, start me by moving... I want to move this to here. Then I'm going to move this to here. And then the Crocosmia to here. Okay. Now we're going to try to propagate you. <laughs> God, I'm wasting. What are we doing? So propagate. That's pretty good. Okay. That's pretty good. I'm going full-blown attack mode, which is probably not intelligent, but... We're, we're, we're trying it. I'd like to move you to here. And then your Cacosmia, like, potentially is gonna die, which is a problem. You still have to water. You're gonna let an attack go down on this guy. Or a health go down on... But the Crocosmia being in this row does not help you at all. Um, so you know what? Let's move... <laughs> ah! <laughs> Why is this so tricky? Um, could also just plant something, right? I mean, a peony does seem intelligent, but I, I don't... I don't love it. God, there's too many decisions, man. There are way too many decisions. Brain is is not uh not in good understanding right now. Okay, I'm going to, to bite the bullet. I'm gonna move you to there, I'm gonna water this. It is what it is. The fountain I, I wanna make the fountain useful, but I I can't, man. I can't make the fountain useful. It's kind of just getting in my way is part of the problem. So two weeds grew. Um can we go to the beach? Can't go to the beach? Fair enough. Oh, I understand. So we left home. We got brunch. We dropped off cleaning. Now we theoretically go to one of these. Check out an apartment listing. How about we visit the tea gardens? Okay. Hello, seamstress. With careful eyes that measure you up and unblinking begin their work. Okay, you got multiple people. Uh, this is a problem. You're dealing 18 damage to me? Bro, I can't, I can't make that work. That's too much damage. Okay, start with that at least. Um, free to play nutmeg. I only have one action left. Um, but you're free to play, so play the, play the bushy basil on you. And then that puts me into 15 to you, because you're free to play. You're gonzo. Ah, but that put me back into this mode. Um, keep keep this as is, okay? Keep this as is. So you're hitting me for 12, which is obviously horrible. I'm very close to dead, right? You're summoning a needle. I understand, okay? I understand. Micro basil. We're now in... in good good realm i hit you for 24 okay 
I hit you for 24. You're dead. I survive. How the hell do I get more health, man? Because resting ain't doing it. Heal 50% is beautiful. <laughs> okay. That's good. It's good. Um, so you have watered this singular tile. I have all this bushy basil that's just kind of vibing. I would like to heal for 50% of my max health, please. Um, can't do anything else there, but that's is fine. Deal damage for for damage equal to your missing health. Chance to make an attack piercing. Chance to raise uh I, I do, I'm going to tell you, I find it very interesting to just go for a... I also wish that I could rotate this, but it is what it is. He, do, do a water here. Um, those are chickweeds up there. Do a water here. And then you're going to find this crazy, but I, I really would like to just try to get some shield onto some of these cards. So your damage equal to the stars in this row we got to get the the blooming you out of there so that you're now a nine to all in row oh you can only use this once by the way very interesting i i actually kind of like my my deck although this wormwood is really valuable i think you need to put this in so put you right here um you'll get watered tomorrow which I think is is lovely. Um, I could just water you today as well. I could move this bushy basil down here and then water you. Ideally, I'm understanding that we want to have maximum cards in, in deck, right? So that you don't get weeds. But it is what it is. <laughs> like, there's only so much that I can do. So check out a new apartment listing. It's the Maw of Power. Something gnaws at the edges of your mind. I got 21 health, man. We're we're chilling. Okay, we're chilling. So this is 14 damage, which frankly is like kind of not that good. Is the crazy part? Like, and it's definitely not. The torch really does attack all. I mean, this is all as well. This card's just not good. The bushy basil is is so insanely better <laughs> than anything else we have right now. And that's fine. I mean, I'm I'm chill with that. You hit me for eight. I have no shield in my deck, so this is not really a surprise in any way. Um, bushy basil, bushy basil. You're putting up thirteen block. I'm gonna tell you, you're you're basically dead next turn. Cause we can go. This is such terrible draw. <laughs> it's horrible draw. Spend an action, reset power to zero, redraw for four cards. I don't really want to do that, though. I think you want to do this, followed by a Torch Lily, to put you at high power for this 24 damage Bushy Basil next turn. Okay. Beautiful. Not too bad. Not too bad. We keep the ball rolling. For five water, upgrade a plant into a variation. You know what? I would like to skip a vendor today uh, because ideally we are, we're, we're doing some nonsense, okay? We're doing some nonsense. I want to buy a lot of plants today. So this gains some thorns, two damage for, for three damage each. This is really good when we can scale it up with um, things like chamomile, right? So you're pretty sick. You're also a two star which is a perfect thing to put into this row. Torch Lily, I don't think is very good at all. The Juniper, I also don't think is very good at all. I'm going to plant this into these guys. You now poison. I mean, that was not very good. <laughs> it was frankly, frankly, freaking horrible, honestly. Reroll me, um, missing health. You're, you're a three star, I'll put you right there. While in hand, when I play attacks, gain shield, you're crazy. You're crazy, I buy you too. Now you need to do some watering. Um, you're going to water this. You're going to water this. And then part of me is like, you don't need to water these other ones. Um, but I'm going to water you. 
Now, when you water something twice, there's a chance it upgrades, right? So there, there is value to doing that. It's, it's so interesting because there's, there's too many. Oh, we lost a bushy basil. That sucks. Um, there's so many things to, to do, right? Q for pineapple buns. Excuse me, the nasty birds. Hello, nasty birds. They can't have that much health, right? Twenty-four apiece. I mean, you're gonna say something nasty, which is kind of that was kind of mean, really. Pretty messed up of you, weird little weird little guy. So give me a. I'm gonna I'm gonna hit you, and then I'm going to. Oh, well, you don't provide stars though. I I would like to bushy basil you. You have to play the knights knights crazcomia next turn. Right? Ah! Very scary. Very scary. Um, okay. This hits for 30 to all of you. Goodbye. <laughs> it's, pretty, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, I would like... I don't know. I'm not sure the item shop really presents me with all that much, but I'll, I'll humor it. That's fine. This, this is... I know that you're like, Tyler, this is not doing you anything over here, but it's... Unfortunately, I I agree, and I don't think there's anything I can do about it. Oxalis that withers if unplayed. I mean, another Nasturtium is pretty freaking Nasturty, in my opinion. Um, so we're going to buy you. Gonna put you right there. Um, I think that raising some shield on some of these guys would be would be great. And then I'm going to go in extremely crazy on the watering here, okay? Because I think that the more that you water, the higher the chance of stuff leveling up. I have no uh, knowledge to back that up for the record, but it it kind of worked. I think we're, we're very likely dead. I, I have one health right now. Nobody want to level up? Fair enough. <laughs> I guess I'll die. That's fine. I guess I'll die. Okay. You know what? You, you had one lose and no weeds. I mean, this is this is the perfect scenario. Um, we're going here. It's a train conductor. Ah. Okay. Hundred and five. <laughs> You're checking my ticket. That doesn't seem good. Um. Well, the elder flower is kind of crazy. It's actually freaking great, man. It's really, really good. That's an amazing card for me. Um, and then you can just bushy basil for another 16. We're getting shield this entire time from the jasmine staying in my hand, which is pretty sick. You check my ticket, you're hitting me for 16, which is obviously not ideal. So, Nas 30 me, which brings in this guy. It gives me two shield, okay. Um, but I think I'd like to hit you for, I mean, you're free to play. This is 24 damage. Unfortunately, this is, although you're doubling, you're doubling. That's so good. That's so good. So whenever I play an attack, does this give me, there's no way this gives me six shield four times. No, just six shield. I will survive this, which is so stupid. Um... Let's hit you for 10. I'm back at high power, and I, I probably kill you on the next turn, which is crazy. Yeah, I definitely do. Okay. I mean, ladies and gentlemen, uh, the Bee Gees are calling. They're happy I'm here. Okay. Um, upgrade a plant into a variation. Let's try it. Let's try it. See where things go. Watering is happening. Our deck is 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 fine, right? It's very fine. I'll convey a wish to one of your plants. It will grow into a variation if it hasn't already. So the basil we have already it has already done what it needs to do. I'm also I'm not optimizing this damn nasturtium, man. Which you're probably mad at me for, and I don't even disagree with you. I need more plants, is is really the issue. Um, but I love this providing me with bushy basils. 
I gotta, I gotta, I gotta do some thinking, okay? Draw all passive cards in deck. I don't know what that means, which is fine. A free peony off of a Nasturtium goes crazy. Okay, that goes crazy. Gain five and thorns. I think that the shield is kind of important. Um, this Jasmine is also really, really important. Um, and the ability to possibly get more bang for the buck on the Jasmine. I would like you to try to grow this Jasmine. I also gain strength. Interesting. Very interesting. I got a, I got a water. Okay. Get the, get the watering. Um, you're going to water these. And then you got you got one more juice to to squeeze here. So this blooming boy, your maximum hitting all four of these. You're just hitting a bushy basil and a burdock, which is is okay. But I think ideally we would rather you swap to here. And if we lose you, obviously you're not getting maximum water this round. If we lose you, it's not the end of the world, is my opinion. There's, there's so many things to think about. I feel like I've played this horribly, which is completely fair, okay? I'll I'll accept the comments on this one. Like, we, we've survived to here. I'm, I'm pleased with it, but I, I have played pretty poorly. Apply is vulnerable to me. Copy is the knight's move. So, too vulnerable to me on this turn. Which is pretty gross. <laughs> pretty gross. Um, I'm on a peony. Draw some cards. I love Starry Jasmine being here. I'm going to Wormwood just to give me some health and some shield. This lines me up for some Starry Jasmine plays. Ouch! It's extremely nasty, but you're free to play, so give me all of my cards right now. Is kind of the idea. Draw all adjacent plants. Uh, it seems that I can only have a certain number of cards in my hand. Which is unfortunate. So do 15 to all enemies. I gain strength and shield. Now draw adjacent plants. No cards to draw. Excuse me. Is that not a free to play card my guy? I feel like that I should have... Excuse me? You're not free to play. Why did... No, you're... <laughs> you're not free to play. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad, bad play. Bad play. Don't, don't kill me because of it. 18. Okay, okay, okay. 22. 22. 22. Starry Jasmine in hand. You got plays. You got plays. Okay, you got plays. Um. I can attack the horse, which is ideal. It's going to give me strength. The only issue is that I, I don't have a lot of... Uh, I don't have a lot of juice here. Um... We can go... Bushy Basil. I mean, like, obviously 36 is really good, but just do 6 here. I'm not dying because you're hitting me for only 22. It's crazy, though. I mean, I'm, I'm at 1 health. Which is a little scary. But I am alive. Um, you're raising your shield. I mean, this is 153 damage. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna skip the vendor and just gain some, some, some happy little water. Happy water. It's a game all about hydration. Uh, that one guy in the comment section, you could go crazy. Okay, um... What do you got? While in hand, gain two thorns when hit. I mean, a peony is, is good. It's very good. Gain more attack. Um, you'd like definitely want to do that on this card. But <laughs> you'd want to put that... You gotta move this crap around, man. You gotta move this crap around. So, so put... We're, we're gonna, we're gonna move you to here. I'm going to raise the attack on these. I mean, that's just a shame, really. That's just a shame. We're going to try to add some effects to these. You gain a combo. And you gain a combo. Okay. Don't ask me what combo does. Um, 
watering can. And a watering can. And a watering can. Hey, Nasturtium goes into blooming. Now you're free to play. That's sick. Okay. Um, you did not water where I wanted you to, but that's okay. Just gives a chance for more things to, to, to grow. Although I think that those have already grown. We, we didn't do much on this round, all, all things considered. We also lost a dandelion, which... Uh, oh, no. <laughs> I mean, I have made it to the boss. Um, I'm assuming this is the boss. Tide rises to meet you. I got one health. I mean, this is 30, 34 damage. You're hitting me for 12. Uh, we're dead. I mean, it's, 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 really, it's really just that simple, to be honest with you. Um... Just kind of dead. The bright side is, holy crap, man, we might actually, we might actually have a kill here. We might actually have a kill. So it's peony into a knight crocosmia into a I don't have I don't have that other card that's the one that I actually need yeah we're cooked <laughs> we're we're cooked you, you you played this for for the huge huge damage if I had dude if I had the this sucker right chamomile would have gone kind of hard during this you're hitting me for 12, I just I just don't have the ability to, to get there. Um, like, I, I can apply poison to you. It's good. Okay, it's, it's highly decent. I still have an action, for what it's worth. Um, this card is not free to play. I keep reading that wrong. Um... Not, none of these are, are good enough. Because even if I rest, right, it's resetting my, my power. You can play this free to play. But the two shield is, is not enough. Resting is, is not good enough. I mean, you're, you're a turn away from beating him, right? Which is, it's unfortunate. Um... If I drew Jasmine, we win. If I drew... It was like... I, I, there were five different cards I could have drawn to win. <laughs> Which is unfortunate. Um, just rest. And I die. It's tight, man. It's tight. It was close. It was very, very close. Um, this is a super fascinating game, man. And obviously you can see that. Uh, I don't need to... I don't even feel the need to, to walk through... Here's what I like and what I don't like. It, it's a truly charming and fascinating little game. Um, I just like it a lot. I, th there's so many decisions that you have to make during this game that it, it increases the complexity and makes it really interesting. Um, obviously, I think it, it suffers in the demo right now from just not having enough cards, but that's because it's a demo, right? Uh, as you gain more builds and more ideas and, and more things, it's gonna it's gonna really flow a lot better. Um, it's a fascinating concept. I, I really enjoyed this one. Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, like on the video, much appreciate. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good rest of your day. Bye bye.